show number 306. This Otaku's Life. So when I was a kid, I just hated doing homework. And I'm sure there was some psychological impact of my parents' divorce at such a young age. And somehow I did okay, came out all right in life. That's not condoning not learning or allowing yourself to be stupid about things. And that's not what this story is about at all. The reason that I'm informing you about that is in our elementary school, one of the things they used to do is they would reward kids that did well. Every once in a while, they rented a movie. They would take over several hours of a day and that was the encouragement factor. Oftentimes what that meant is that I had to write book reports. I learned about writing and one of the things that I learned that stayed with me, don't repeat yourself. The fear of repeating. I often want to keep moving and iterating and it always goes back to that notion. We often do that. We loop all the time and I became aware of patterns. I learned that I didn't want to waste the time that I have. Try new things and always learn. Try not to stay stuck in a loop or you'll end up where you started. Thank you everyone once again for listening and downloading. And I don't know, maybe that was worthy of of your attention. I hope it is. I think it's a good tip that in writing, try not to repeat your sentences, try not to repeat your statements. You know, there's easy ways to cheat that. Say the same thing in different ways. I think it's a healthy thing and uh, to be aware of it. It's good not to be, uh, not to be stuck. So anyhow, I think that's the core of it. I'm going to stop rambling. I'm I'm doing too much of that. Number of ways you can reach out. You can always email us at thisattackerslife at gmail.com. YouTube and Twitter at thisattackerslife life og networks on instagram and snapchat and we have websites this is life.com and og networks.tv so thank you everyone once again for listening and downloading and oh by the way if you have android or even ios we have been featured on castbox.fm and the app and uh, it's a pretty good app uh and if you want to make the ads go away it's uh, at least on android it was only three dollars so uh we've been there for a while and uh i thought it was worthy of mentioning so until next week everyone have a good one